Thumbelina by Hans Christian Andersen is a classic fairy tale that weaves together elements of fantasy, adventure, and the enduring theme of the triumph of goodness over adversity. First published in 1835, this story tells the captivating journey of a tiny, thumb-sized girl named Thumbelina, exploring themes of identity, resilience, and the transformative power of love. At its core, Thumbelina is a narrative that explores the concept of identity and the struggle to find one's place in the world. Thumbelina, born from a barleycorn, is immediately faced with the challenge of being different from the world around her. Her thumb-sized stature sets her apart, making her vulnerable to the whims of nature and other creatures. This physical uniqueness becomes a metaphor for the broader human experience of feeling out of place in a world that often seems indifferent or hostile. As Thumbelina encounters various creatures on her journey, the story reflects the unpredictable nature of life and the importance of adaptability. From the mole who wants to marry her to the swallow who befriends her, Thumbelina faces different challenges and opportunities. The mole represents a life of comfort and security, but it also symbolizes a confined existence devoid of true freedom. Thumbelina's refusal to settle for this life reflects her inner strength and determination to seek a place where she truly belongs. The character of the swallow plays a pivotal role in Thumbelina's journey. The swallow represents freedom and the spirit of adventure. In literature, Birds often symbolize transcendence and the ability to rise above earthly concerns. The swallow's friendship introduces Thumbelina to a world beyond her immediate surroundings, exposing her to different landscapes and perspectives. Through this friendship, Anderson emphasizes the transformative power of companionship in shaping one's understanding of the world and oneself. Love, both romantic and platonic, is another central theme in Thumbelina. Thumbelina's encounters with the flower fairy prince and the field mouse's son highlight the complexities of relationships. The flower fairy prince, drawn to Thumbelina's beauty, represents a superficial attraction. In contrast, the field mouse's son, despite his kind intentions, lacks the understanding and sensitivity needed to appreciate Thumbelina for who she truly is. Through these relationships, Anderson comments on the importance of genuine connection and emotional depth in meaningful relationships. The changing seasons in the narrative serve as a metaphor for the cyclical nature of life. Thumbelina experiences the warmth of spring, the heat of summer, and the harshness of winter. Each season brings new challenges and opportunities, mirroring the ebb and flow of human experiences. The symbolism of seasons adds depth to the narrative, emphasizing the inevitability of change and the resilience required to navigate life's uncertainties. As Thumbelina's journey unfolds, the story subtly challenges traditional gender roles. Thumbelina is not a passive damsel in distress waiting to be rescued by a prince, instead, she takes an active role in shaping her destiny. Her courage, intelligence, and resilience make her a symbol of empowerment. Anderson, writing in the 19th century, introduces a character who defies conventional expectations, offering a progressive portrayal of femininity for his time. In conclusion, Thumbelina is a timeless fairy tale that resonates with readers of all ages. Through its exploration of identity, resilience, love, and the cyclical nature of life, Hans Christian Andersen crafts a narrative that transcends its fairy tale origins, offering profound insights into the human experience. Thumbelina's journey becomes a universal metaphor for the challenges and triumphs inherent in the quest for self-discovery and a sense of belonging.